Hi everyone, viewers question time. It is from Mark. Mark asks, I have been doing your meditations and stuff for several weeks. Amazing, thanks so much. I have just received a few texts from my specific person after no contact for three weeks. In brackets, broke up about three to four weeks ago and then the space before that. End of bracket. We texted light daily stuff and it feels like she's interested again. Thanks to you, as pretty sure LOA helped with all of this. What should I continue to do? Self-love meditations? Yes. Why? Because the more loved you feel, Mark, the more you attract love on the outside. The more unloved you feel, the more you attract the absence of somebody. Okay? I think self-love meditations are really important. And I think that they are the foundation of the work that needs to be done because you have to feel love within. And I think to have a great relationship, you have to be in a state of being able to give that, not trying to suck love out of a relationship, but being able to give love to a relationship. Okay. Now, how often I would, I would do self-love meditations about four five times a week. I think doing any technique seven days a week is just too much. People get exhausted. So self-love meditation first. I would also do affirmations. I am loved. I am wanted. I'm deserving. I'm worthy. I'm secure. I'm a priority. I'm good enough. I'm important. I matter. I'm first best. I would do those types of affirmations because they reinforce what you're doing in your self-love meditation. Uh, you've asked should I continue to do get an ex to text me? No. I think that is a lower level thing to do. You might do that maybe once or twice, but that's still about getting. Even though, you know, you're focusing on the wanted, I would probably shy away from that a little bit. Sending out love to SP. Yes, there is a great meditation called Radiating Love Out to Another. It's on my meditation channel. I'll put the link down below. And any other radiating love out meditations I will put down below as well. And projection meditations, yes, because that's about giving. Whispering technique, I would do that sparingly. That is still on some level trying to get something. Um, but if you use the whispering technique to say, hey, um, how about we have a wonderful meal together and we share a glass of wine. So that's about two people receiving. It's not just about getting. So modify it as a higher grade. Okay, higher grade tech way of doing that technique, I mean. Yes, you can write a script. I'm happy and grateful now that. There's a whole scripting playlist. I will put the link down below for you. And also, <clears throat> I, I think if you really keep your mental diet good, I will put a uh, YouTube down below for that so you can follow that as well. Okay, lots of love Mark and I will add everything in down below for you and you know, you're on the right track, just keep working on you. Relationships only reflect back to you what you've got going on. The better the relationship, the better your mental and emotional state has to happen first, okay? They are a projection screen of how good you are really doing. All right? Lots of love. And uh, let us know how you go.